Well, dark streets will no longer be an issue for the city of Springfield. City leaders are using some federal grant money to replace more than 3,000 street lights with LEDs over the next few months. And KEZI 9 News reporter Jennifer Singh shows us why residents say these lights are so necessary. The city of Springfield has been replacing all of its street lights with LEDs in phases over the past couple of years. But new funding from the American Rescue Plan Act, which was passed by Congress in 2021 in response to the COVID-19 pandemic, now allows the city to replace all street lights that have yet to be replaced all within the next four to five months. We gain a lot of efficiency by doing a bunch at once because the crew can go from one light to the next to the next. And so it's a lot more cost effective to do them in a, a large group rather than one at a time. And he tells me the new lights themselves will also be extremely cost efficient in the long run. The LED lights are about 70% more efficient, uh, 60 to 70% more efficient, and they also require a lot less maintenance. Scott Miller says these new lights will require less maintenance because of new advanced controls, which allow them to monitor the lights and know which street lights may need repairs and which may need to be dimmed directly from a tablet or from a computer. In the past, we had a limited ability to deal with that. And with this new uh, control system, we'll have a, mu a much better capability to respond to uh, the needs of the residents in Springfield. And residents say they've been needing those light replacements for years now. I talked to residents who say these new lights will provide a better sense of safety throughout the city and within their individual neighborhoods. I want my I want my neighborhood to be lit up and um, it'll make me feel safer. Like if I walk my dogs at night and stuff to just everything for me to be able to see. Yeah. Scott Miller with the city of Springfield says they believe the need to report faulty lights will go down. But he still encourages people to reach out if anything looks out of place. We want to hear about it. We want to know about it because we want to provide good service to the citizens of Springfield. In Springfield, Jennifer Singh, KEZI 9 News.